boss can't figure it out, they go to another guy. They can't figure out, they go to another guy. They can't figure out, they go to another guy. That guy, his boss, calls Conrad. <laughs> So, do you know your electronics too? Uh, yes. Yeah, okay. So, my question to you is, I've got a, I bought an 05 Silverado back in 07. Okay. Um, did some local driving, six, six liter with the 4 L80. Okay. Um, the mileage is horrible. So I yanked it out, I put a 5.9 Cummins in it. Okay. And I loved it, it doubled my you mileage. Did what? I pulled the six liter gas out of the Silverado, I put a 5.9 Cummins in it. Why would you do that? Why would I do that? Because it doubled my mileage. I why saved didn't $120 you, every time I filled Why didn't, you go, why didn't you go back to what was in it? A six liter gas? Yeah. Why didn't you go 6.3? Why didn't you even try five? Three? I mean, uh, why, why not? I mean, maybe, maybe there was there was excessive wear and tear in that engine. No, no, it was meticulously maintained. Yeah. I bought it with 100,000 K. I'm very yeah. diligent with my old changes yeah. in that. So, yeah. so now my wife wanted a vehicle that sounded like a tractor. So okay. I'm I've got an 04 Tahoe right now that's in good shape. I pulled the it had a blown head gasket. You know, I picked it up nice and cheap. So it's getting a four cylinder Cummins and a four VT 3.9 liter. But because it's got all the options on there, your tire pressures and, and you're your... not even going to have to get that emission test. It's no, I know. Rod. I know. <laughs> That's why you're doing this. <laughs> really? I, I know where you're going with yeah, this. Yeah, but I'm also You'll doubling never have my to mileage. Test that ever again. I'm getting. I'm going to get 30 miles to the gallon out okay. of a, out of a full size okay. Tahoe. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Now, can I reflash the computer to ixnay the inputs from the engine and the transmission so sure that it can. doesn't say reduce tension? Sure, you can. So I can. Now you're, are you going to ask me how to do it? No. Uh, I I want somebody to look me in the face and say, yes, that's possible. Bring it to the best electrician guy at the GM dealership Eddie, and Eddie, he can reflash. Uh, I don't know about that. No? Okay. No. That won't happen. No? Is he recording all this? <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're, doing, you're doing very well. Yeah. Very well. Oh, like, well, I, yeah, you're very impressive. At, yeah, you're you know, I, I look at it from the perspective of, I, I wouldn't do it because if something happens catastrophic right. to that engine and or the tranny, I, I'm not paying for it. No. Well, it's, it's a 10-year-old truck. So. It doesn't matter. No, it eh? doesn't matter. I mean, you you buy you, you can buy a, trans, a, a rebuilt transmission for a 20-year-old vehicle. Right. You know, uh, the vehicle's not under, under warranty, but that transmission is. Right, right, right. You know, so I, I, I think people will probably be, you know, concerned in, in taking the, the risk. Right, you know, right. You almost have to find someone who is just a, um, how do I say it, like just, just a writer. Right. Who can, right. Who can tap into, you know, hex code and, yeah, yeah. and check some and, and physically move, you know, physically move coding around to get what you want. Right, but it right. is a language that is, yeah, yeah. you know, you, right. it takes years to learn it. Right, like, right, and right. you'd have to go to someone very, very specialized. Yeah. Is there anyone in Toronto? I think most of those guys are probably in the class. Really? So follow a variety of projects that include conversions and repairs to anything from Ferraris to chainsaws. And check out the Tape Boss, my newest invention that's coming to market. And remember, if you're not filthy, you're not rich.